Geektastic Quickie. When Nintendo made the announcement that their president and CEO, Satoru Iwata, passed away on July 11th, and it was due to um, complications with a growth in his uh, bile duct, apparently he's been fighting this for a while, and it's not a good thing to have. Bile is necessary for digestion, and it's produced by your liver, and anything dealing with your liver that can harm your liver is definitely not good. Apparently, this is why he has not actually attended E3 for the past couple of years. Now, he was seen recently in Nintendo's latest digital event for E3, and he was even immortalized as a Muppet by the Jim Henson Company. And you now it's this this happens very suddenly. He became the uh, the head of Nintendo in 2000. He was born in 1959, about more than 10 years after the Second World War. And he also worked in the HAL Laboratories in Nintendo. He was responsible for the success of the Kirby series. And, you know, he was there during the launch of the Wii, the rather rough launch of the Wii U. He also launched the DS and 3DS. So, you know, he's, he's been there through some of the company's biggest moments and some other roughest moments. Uh, Shingiro Miyoto and one other is going to run the company while they decide who's going to replace him. And there's no word on who will be the new CEO. Um, no names have been suggested yet. We're certain they're a corporation, so they're certainly going to make some kind of announcement eventually on who's going to replace him. And right now, um, you know, the company is in good hands. You know, Nintendo's not in any serious trouble. So, you know, Kirby fans right now have a lot to be sad about. And he was a very great man. He opened the company up, made it less impersonal, made it less secretive, and he will be missed. Hope you enjoyed the show. Geektastic Weekly will be a bi-weekly program discussing the latest news in entertainment, games, and technology. If you liked what you heard, please consider subscribing and hitting that like button. See you next time.